It sure is in is. full swing, and in addition to getting outside, going on vacation, and taking some much-needed R&R, it's also the perfect time to have some fun with your makeup look. I caught up with the team from Z Salon and Spa to break down the hottest trends you'll see this summer. Take a look. Summer is the perfect time to ditch those heavier foundations, maybe go a little bit lighter, maybe even embrace some brighter pops of color. Myla's here at Z Salon and Spa to talk us through the top beauty trends. And there's so many bright colors out there this year. Absolutely. Pinks are very much in trend for this season. Very bright colors, metallic shades. Um, my only recommendation for metallic shades for a much richer audience would be to do it in moderation. <laughs> okay. yeah. Less can be more, but it can still be very much effective. Right. So as seen on Krista here, I did a soft, smoky on the outer corners just to make it a little bit sultry with a little bit of a hint of, of metallic shadow just to showcase and brighten up her eyes a little bit. And as well as on Adrian here, I, I kept the same neutral palette of the pinks because the pinks is very in this season with a soft, smoky eyes. Black is not in, a sultry brown is. Sultry brown is in. And of course, I think what makes it too is just the blending and the tools you use to make it happen. A very detailed blending brush goes a long way. She only has on one shadow. It's literally just the just the one. Blending. Uh -huh. blending, blending, blending is key. Using the same brush as well for Krista, she's literally two shadows and a little metallic shimmer goes a very long way. And, and what about with those lipsticks? Is it more of a matte? Are we still seeing some glosses? We see a little bit of a gloss. I personally chose to do a matte. So you're eating, you're out, you're having mimosas yep. with your friends. You might want to have a more long lasting and then you can put a gloss on top like I did with Krista. But the pink for Adrian, very much a velvet matte. Beautiful. And what about foundations? When it's get warmer, you don't want to do such a heavy foundation. I recommend doing something more on the dewy side, a more buildable coverage. What you don't want is to be so hot and then you start to you feel like your face is on the table. <laughs> exactly. So something along those lines, softer, softer coverage. You could always build it later if you need be. Okay, you make this look so easy, right? <laughs> but what if we need a little help? Do you all have consults here where before I go and buy that whole new, you know, fresh palette, can I visit with you to kind of show me the best ways to use Absolutely. it. Absolutely, you can always come in. We're always welcome, welcoming for those. We do offer makeup lessons and and we can offer you to teach you step by step of how to do it. Uh, thank you so much. Looks beautiful. Thank you. All right, to schedule your consult, all you have to do is go to zsalon.com.